I am here with a flip through of February in my daily details planner. I am so excited that we are, I don't know, like through the second month, it feels kind of crazy. So yeah, I am just going to show you what I'm working with here and then yeah, we can check out and start up March in the next video. So thank you guys again for being here. I do very much appreciate you. So for February, I didn't do much with the notes page here. And so what I'm finding, I'm finding that I, I might want a more like structured dashboard. I know. I have said for years that I want another page of notes that's coordinated and all of that, but I'm not finding that I need them in like my personal life planner, especially because I have my on the go planner where a lot of my notes end up going. So this planner ends up kind of staying at home. Oh, I don't know. The, the joys of being a planner, I suppose, but that, so that's blank. And then I did not really use my February monthly very well this month. I got myself into a planner funk. I was talking with some of my followers, friends, I guess, I kind of hate to call them followers over on Instagram. And you know, I was just in a bit of a planner funk. I had some anxiety stuff going on, just some like overall like wah wah, I don't know. It just wasn't, it wasn't a great month for me around that, so. Yeah, so there is February monthly, nothing very spectacular, not super decorative at all. But I wanted to make sure that I didn't fall behind in my weekly planning. So I felt like if I was gonna sacrifice something, it was going to be my monthly spread. My weekly spreads, I mean, they're not perfect, <laughs> but, and I did kind of take the easy way out with a few of them. So this one came, all these stickers came from the newest, well not newest because there's a newer one coming out now. It's the light blue color story book that has come out pretty recently. And yeah, I really liked it. I was really inspired to use this one for the first week of February because of all of the like love stickers and the pink floral. It felt really pretty for February, but not quite Valentine's. So it does have some foiling on here. So like there's some little foiling down here that's hard to see a little bit in the bright light. So, and there's a little bit of foiling here. So I love how it turned out. It was very feminine and girly. It was a lot of fun to do. So this one is great. Someone asked me the other day why I don't check stuff off of my to-do lists and basically they're just like reference points for me. It doesn't work in my brain, I guess, to check stuff off. If it's already done, it won't be on the checklist for the next day. That's kind of how my brain works. So it's like an ongoing list, I suppose, is how it works for me. So, but that's a great question. Okay, this was my Valentine's spread. It was so fun. It looks like Valentine's threw up all over my planner. I love that. When I'm decorating for a holiday week, that is what I want. I want my planner to look like the holiday threw up all over the pages. So a lot of these books came from the seasonal, the little tiny sticker book, and then also from one of the memory keeping sticker books. So I love how it turned out. This week was a lot of fun. We ended up getting a date night in. So yeah, this is my favorite, like my favorite thing ever. Buy me chocolate and tell me I'm pretty. Like that is kind of what inspired this spread. So I really like how it turned out and I'm kind of bummed that Valentine's is over so I can't look at it anymore. <laughs> Okay, and then this is this current week actually. So I actually filled in the rest of my the rest of my checklist just to have a complete spread to show to you guys. But these stickers came out of the 5144 sticker book from Joann's and I loved it. I thought this was so fun and I wanted to, you know, use the party stickers because we're gonna have a little planner meetup on a Saturday evening afternoon. And so I felt like celebrating and I just liked the purples, how it kind of goes with what's on the page here. I love it. These like balloon stickers, oh my gosh, you guys, so cute. I had so much fun with this spread. So I hope that you liked it as well. And then I just finished doing a plan with me on this spread. So you probably have seen that before you see this video. So if you haven't watched it, I'll link it down below. And yeah, this is the next upcoming week. I felt like since we were going into March, it's time to get real florally and pastel-y. Like I'm, I'm ready for it. So I'm very excited about all of the floral spreads that are coming and all of the like soft girly spreads. I'm also excited for a green week, the week of St. Patrick's Day. So stay tuned for all of that. But those are my spreads so far. February was a short month. So yeah, and 
I don't know you guys, I'm in a bit of a planner dilemma. So I really like the, I think it's called a Happy Doodles or something planner that's coming out. It's an 18 month planner. I don't usually use all 18 months, but I kind of want to get it. But I also still really love daily details. So let me know what you think down in the comments below. I'm definitely gonna pick it up and look at it. I also, I saw Kita's new spread and setup and she is using a monthly classic size and I am intrigued by that as well. So many options, oh my gosh, I just love me some good happy planners and I love changing stuff up. So let's take a peek back through all of the spreads and I will keep you guys posted. My Hobby Lobby is supposed to get all of the new stuff in on Monday, so I'm hoping to go shopping, and then I'll fill up the rest of my wish list if I don't get everything from either Joann's or from the Mambi shop. So if you like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up for me. If you're new around here, don't forget to hit the red subscribe button down below, as well as a notification bell. If you are one of my current followers, thank you so much for all of your love and support. And if you wanna find me over on other social sites. You can find me over on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. And by the way, you guys, have fun today. Bye.